Twas the day of Christmas and already awake was an excited young Ed, excited as cake. He summoned the others and ran to the tree to uncover the presents awaiting them three. As they grabbed their gifts, they unwrapped them fast, but their joyful expressions sure didn't last. Ed found a bottle of discount Coke, Matt a joke book with only one joke. For his present this year, Tom received a poster of a picture of Matt admiring a toaster. The cards they read, which increased their woe, were letters from fans. Can I be on your show? The phone suddenly rang, disrupting their sadness. On the line was Matt's grandma. He answered with gladness. She wasn't too happy about the fact he hadn't called her for two years flat. Several more hours later, after the phone call had finished, Ed's Christmas feast was done and the others were famished. Ed presented his bird for them to admire. But little did he know, it was still on fire. The fire then spread to the potatoes and mash. But soon the whole dinner was alight in a flash. So after the fire was extinguished with gravy, they rescued dear Matt, still screaming like a lady. They sat on the sofa and turned on their telly. And soon their sad faces were transformed into merry. So to make the most of your Christmas, there's really only one way. Anyone can enjoy the television, even those who hate this day. Okay, guys, from the top. Why the top? Let's try not to screw up this time. You're a screw up. Sorry. One and the two and the one, two, three. Wait, what song are we doing again? We wish wish you a Merry Christmas. Christmas. We We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Why did we... What? Uh, That was... Fantastic! Uh, Well, that sucked. You suck. Oh.